wait, hold on, hold on. Wait, um... Look, if it's cool with you, could you hang out for a little while? Look, Awesome and Ellie think that I'm kind of getting lucky in here, and I wouldn't want to disappoint them. Oh, um... Uh, how long do you want me to stay? 42 minutes and 15 seconds. Arcade Fire's first album, it's like a auditory aphrodisiac. You're not really ready for it yet. I'll... Okay, here we go. Just gotta... mm -hmm. Why were you waiting for me in my room, anyway? Well, I wanted to surprise you. Um, uh, it's, uh, it's us at Comic-Con. What do you think? It's, it's great. <laughs> but we've never actually been to Comic-Con, have we? Wow, we, we actually look like a real couple. Well, we are a real couple. We're just a different sort of a couple. That we are. What are you, what are you doing? Uh, smile. Smile. <laughs> I, uh, I wanted to give you a new photo of us and I figured that it should be something real. Hey, why is this door What, what are you doing? Whoa! Wow. Girl on top. Miss Walker. When Hair Winner Licia signs her paycheck, I doubt he's factoring in makeup breaks with your boy toy. I'm sorry, I had to act fast. You can change in the bathroom. That's okay. What? You give me crap about lighting some candles and you come in wearing that? What, this? This, this is part of my cover. Well, it doesn't cover a thing. And what if Ellie or Awesome were to walk in? This is exactly what a girlfriend would wear to seduce her boyfriend. I am just being professional. Yeah. The world's oldest profession. Oh, right. Well, that's real nice, Chuck. What is the matter with you tonight, anyway? No, wait, 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 wait. Not yet, not yet. Why? What's the matter? Nothing. It's just that this... This will probably be the last chance that I have to know the truth. I know you're, you're just doing your job here, but sometimes it feels so real, you know? So tell me, you and me, us, our thing under the undercover thing, is this ever going anywhere? I'm sorry, Chuck. No. Got it. Got it, thank you for being honest. Even though I guess you don't really have a choice in the matter. Um, Sarah. You know when you think you're gonna die and your whole life is supposed to flash in front of you? That didn't exactly happen for me yesterday. In fact, mostly it was just a list that I saw. A list of stuff that I haven't done and things that I haven't had a chance to say. So today, today I wanna start crossing things off of my list. And this is the first thing that I promised myself that I'd do. We need to break up. What? You know, you know, like fake, fake breakup, our pretend relationship. I just can't do this anymore, you know? The longer we go, the longer we keep trying to fool people into believing that we're a real couple, 
person I keep fooling the most is me. yourself? Uh, no. If I hadn't been trained to withstand pentothal, I might have. Well, it's hard to have a real relationship in this line of work. Apparently, it's hard to have a fake one as well. Well, if it's any consolation, I never felt like our time together was work. It was nice knowing you. Well, the good news is we're alive. And the bad news is that this is kind of an uncomfortable moment right now. It's completely comfortable on my end. Just saying. Look, it's also kind of a kind of a thank you for believing me when you had good reason not to. Well, it's my job, you know. It's what I do. It's the one thing I'm good at. Really? Because I'm pretty sure you're good at a lot of things. Well, as you can see from everything that happened with Bryce, I'm not so good at relationships. I guess that makes two of us. And then that makes me good at pretty much nothing, I suppose. Chuck, you're good at your job, too. And not just here fixing computers. You know, the one where you risk your life to save others, the one that you didn't ask for, but were supposed to have. Friends? Yeah, friends. And hey, there's a silver lining to this too, you know? Because we're not working together anymore, which means we can go on a date. You can come by my cell and we can hang out and you can tell me who the president is. And maybe, uh, maybe we can see how we really feel. Goodbye, Sarah. Chuck. Save you later. 